like I'm a little kitty can. And she's punching me in the face with my own fist. Okay. This is you. And this is a space that only you can occupy. Out here is everything else. Comments on your appearance, people's expectation of you, traffic. Is this about boundaries? Because how am I supposed to have boundaries with someone who won't Healthy even- Healthy boundaries come with practice. Small, deliberate actions taken over time. Sorry, that was my... Boundaries are about practice. All done? All done. Sorry, I thought my music might be too loud. It's okay. We will get this figured out. Are you drinking your water? Always. You're mad. I made you look unprofessional, didn't I? No. The empty box of tampons next to the garbage make me look unprofessional. Is it the maintenance guy <sighs> call? Yeah, he said it's the motor. He said he went ahead and got a new one ordered. The delivery guys should hook it up on Monday. Monday. There's another week of smelling like B.O. I like your B.O. <sighs> Please don't be mean to me. I don't like it when you're mean to me. Can we have a date night? Tonight? Please? Okay. I know you're super busy and stressed, but I just worry that you're getting bored with me or having doubts. Okay. We will make it a date night. And you are going to get it. Ooh. Pure. Unfiltered. Unaltered. Uncensored. So professional. <laughs> For me, it's like they're handing out coupon books for fucking me in the ass. Jacob. This is a surprise. You're looking well. You look like shit. Oh, hey, your brother's here. I packed my things up. <laughs> Can't believe it all fits in my car. Well, I left most of it. It's all shit anyway. This must be really hard for you. It is. You can't stay here. <laughs> Fuck. I want to be clear. You have options, but this isn't one. I'm sure that you'll find something. You should stay here tonight. Really? Yeah, make a dinner. I'm gone in the morning. Thursday at the latest. As long as you need. Why didn't you tell me you had a brother? I haven't seen him in years. I don't like finding out important information about your life this way. This is an example of something you should volunteer. Can we not? Please. 
I'm thinking zucchini for dinner. So, I didn't know Eileen had a brother. <laughs> yep. She must not tell you much either. I didn't even know she had a roommate. Well, it's hard to tell you anything when I haven't seen you for so long. So, Jacob, are you reading anything? A few things, actually. Um, one is by this sex therapist. Eileen, you'd like it. It's very thorough. It's got this great breakdown on all the positions. I'll let you borrow it if you want. I am good, thank you though. I'll take a look at it. It's great. I mean, she's made me entirely rethink my approach to the G-spot. Can we not at the um, dinner table, please? Sure. Mm. That reminds me, you have to see this. I found this in the attic. From the house? How did you get in? Climbed in. Look, this is all the Oregon Trail stuff around Portland. They matched all these old maps up with the current streets. Now, look at that. What? That's the house. You see it? But the house wasn't built until the 70s. No, I mean the land. Look, look where it is. This line here is the Oregon Trail. Like the actual trail. It goes goes right through the property. Yeah, you didn't know that. What? You did? Well, not that it went through the property, but close to it. Dad used to talk about it all the time. Why you gotta shit on this? I'm not shitting. Well, I think it's cool. I just stood out in the field. Imagine the wagons rolling by. Blacksmiths pounding metal, chickens running around, pioneers making love in the trees. That's beautiful. It's all that history. It's right there in our backyard. Well, I want to see it. We could go tomorrow. That would be great. That would be really great. Um, but maybe another time? Because Shay and I already have plans. And I'm sure that you can find a way to occupy yourself tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah, I got, um, I got stuff I got to take care of downtown. Wow. Okay. Way to use your words. Do you know why I'm mad? Yes then I don't need to use my words. <sighs> this is my place and I can let in whomever I want. And I don't care if that was the right or wrong use of whom, so just don't. This was our date night. Yes, it was. I had a good time. I'm sorry if you didn't, but that's not my responsibility. Whatever helps you not be so insecure. Hello. Oh, hey, uh, Irene, right? Do you have any, like, club soda or ginger ale or something?
So, are you two back together? Back together. Oh, no, that was Nessa. She's an optometrist. Oh, of course. I, I wouldn't. No. I should apologize. I didn't welcome you, and that's not fair. You don't deserve that. So I want to be supportive. Whatever it is you need, if it's money for a new place, we'll work it out. Eileen, I don't need money. You just missed our morning guest. Nessa left already? Aw, I just found her some emodium. Not there. Oh. I gave Jacob our spare key. Shay. He has to have a way to get in and out, and we can't leave the place open all day. It's not permanent. Okay. It. No, it'll just make me upset. I'll call him tonight. Just get it over with. Thinking about talking to him doesn't stress me out. It's having just talked to him that stresses me out. Can't believe it took me six years to learn that. I don't want to be a nagging girlfriend. You're not. I'm sorry I ruined date night. Let me make it up to you, okay? I needed to get an A on that paper. Else they're gonna bench me. They know. I'm really sorry. Please give me another chance. Coach said he'd let it slide. But you see, now I'm all stressed out.
And I don't play so well when I'm all stressed out. So, what are we gonna do about that? Where'd you go for Thai food? Thai food's good. I like Thai food. Did mom know? Why not? Margaret, when? Do you remember Margaret? No. I don't. Yeah, you do. Margaret, when? You two used to play doctor in the camper after school. That is not what happened. Tongue depressor, stethoscope. Okay, we don't need to do the details of that. I mean, she was hot, so that's... Well. So I got a question. Are you... 
Do you guys like take turns or just okay, that's experience with that? You don't have to tell me. We don't need to, you don't have to tell you know, me. I mean, that's fine. This doesn't don't. need to be. Does she dress no, up as the football no, player No, we're just going <sighs> to. You know, I'm, I'm glad. Uh, I'm glad I, I know that I, that I know about you now. I'm, I'm glad that you know. Eileen, can you come in here, please? Mm, what's happening? It's okay. It's gonna be okay. What? What is it? Do you it? want some warm water? I can fill up the tub. Is this a baby? No, idiot. It's a kidney stone. Pills. Get the pills. They're right behind you. They're in the prescription bottle. Right there in the medicine cabinet. Don't you think she needs a doctor? No, she's already been to the ER. We're gonna be paying off that bill for the rest of the year. No, hospital. It'll pass. I'm okay. I'm okay. Yes, your hand is right on it. God. Oh, these look bigger. I don't think she should take those. I don't want any of your hippie naturopathic bullshit right now, okay? Those aren't painkillers. I mean, well, they're... They're just Tylenol. I... I took the painkillers. You took her pills? Go get them! No, I... took them. God! Okay. The hospital! Car! How's she doing? She's still sleeping. They think you need to go. Okay. You say it's not about money, so if it's just for convenience, then you need to find another place. I'd still like to get together and talk with you sometime. I'm pretty busy this month. So, no, it's never gonna happen. Not right now. I was hoping it would be less stress if I stayed here. That's ridiculous, but okay. I mean, for us hanging out, because we'd already be around each other, we wouldn't have to plan it. Maybe we can plan a lunch after this month. After this month, wow, okay. You want to hang out, Jacob? Great. Let's do it. But this, what you're doing here, is not about us hanging out. What do you think it is? A control game? I don't know. Maybe you like making people feel uncomfortable. I don't want to make you feel uncomfortable. Well, you are. So. I never asked mom about dad. I never cared to. And I never asked mom about herself. What she was like when she was a kid or, or when they were together. I don't know anything about either of them. 30 fucking years old and I still don't know. And you, if this is it, I'm gonna walk out and 
in another 30 years, I still won't know. Why are you doing this right now? I'm not doing so good. When I'm alone, I get so... It's bad. I just don't care like, when I'm in it, but then I come out of it and just I get, I get scared just thinking how close I was. Jacob, if you think you're gonna hurt yourself, then you need to get some help. If it's that bad, then I will drive you to the hospital right now. You don't believe me. I may not fully understand how you feel, but I believe you. Bullshit. You think I'm lying. You can see it on your face. This face? This is my, I have been up all night at the ER because of my addict brother face. You gotta make a great therapist. Oh, Jacob, what the hell am I supposed to think? I fucking come here. My darkest truth, and all you can do is give me that fucking look. You cannot expect me to be open just because you are ready to talk. I'm not expecting you to do a goddamn thing. I would just hope you'd listen. I have always been listening to you and your bullshit to mom. You talk, I listen. You fuck up, I fix it. That's how our relationship always went. See, that's what I'm getting at. I never knew you felt like that. I want to know these things. I realized I've been so self-absorbed my whole life. I don't know who you are. I cannot do this right now. We don't have to, but seeing you once a month won't be enough. You can't stay here. So that's it? I have a life. say this enough, but I really care about you. This isn't just some phase. So I don't want you to feel insecure. I know that I get busy at work and distracted and that I have a lot of fucked up feelings towards my family, but I am not doubting us. Maybe I am.
Two.